hello there and welcome to today's class for today we're trying to produce the isometric production that you are seeing at the right hand side of the screen to produce an isometric our first task is to draw the isometric asx right so i'll draw a horizontal line this way right and i'll pick a point here to draw a vertical line as in this case right a vertical line so draw a vertical line this way and then i'll take my t set t square on my on my set square this way i'll draw this 30 degree next up i'll take this one here this way and i'll take it down this way so i have this is this will be refers to isometric asics when you are done what's your next tax next task is to get the entire length width and height of course my entire length there is 80 from here to here is 80 right this is 80 here this is one year so it's zero to 80 here the entire width is 60 so from here to somewhere here is 60 which is 60 here and finally my entire height is um 75 so 75 at this point here so with this three point i'll produce out that figure here so i'll use this three point project this upward to form a box and i'll project this one here upward this way such that i'll connect this height this one here this height with this and similarly with that same um height there i'll take it down this way such that i will extend this one here down and i'll use this to close it up i'll close it up i'll close this point here to this so this this is the boss the box um with which that figure was seen at the um right as of the screen is being got formed right so next task now is to observe that from here to your sticking which are we taking mine you can see of course here to here to is ticking i'll take in mine right also here to this point here is ticking which i'll take in mine too what next observe that observe please observe observe that there's an there's a there's a distance of 25 and 25 which make 50 so i'll measure 50 this is 50 here and 25 is the center here right so such that they are both so okay hang on such that i will take each point inward i'll take this point here in now I'll take this point here too in in this sense here right now i'll come to this point here this one here and measure 20 so from here to here is 20 and i'll take in it this 20 here yeah? right such that um next tax now is that i'll take this in right i'll take this in to touch this one here yeah? take this in to touch this one here yeah? right then i will um project the point downward take this down to touch this similarly i can just close it up close here up this way so i have this right such that i can now easily close this part here up since i've gotten my dimension correctly all right from here now what is obviously my next procedure next task is that i'll take my meter rule there's a height of 50 so from here to here is 50 and it's ticking so take this down 50 this is um 20 here and it's ticking i'll take in the 20 similarly from here to here to is 20 i'll take in the 20 as you can see the figure at the right answer of the screen so i'll take this 20 upward that is 20 upward with a faint line don't forget that we just measured 50 then i'll take my t square and um 
close year to year up now close year to year up such that i will close year up finally now come here and i'll close year up finally so i have this so close this one here too up i have this all right proceeding from here what is my next tax next tax is to take this edge here i'll take this in and i'll take um this point here too in take this one here too in and take this in with a faint line such that i'll come to this point here uh, measure 15 inward 1.5 so and i'll take in it um i'll use that this square this way then i'll close here to here up as you can see and i can actually come here and close this up right um observe that my next tax is to take this one here down to touch this line i drew here you can see and i'll take my t square this way and let them consign together to meet at this point right so the tax now is that i'll take this one here and this point here such that i will take this and close it up to this so i have this here um next tax now is that i'm going to take this point here downward different line right and i will take this one here this one here to so meet this line here that i drew downward now close it up close them up close this up i have this so i'm going to take my t square this way around observe hang on okay take it down this way i'll take it this way and um i'll place it copy this way i have this right so tax now is that with this curve here, I'm going to transfer points. Observe, observe what I'm going to do. Take this point here in to this point with a faint line. Now take that point, this one here. I will extend it down this way, such that I will drop this one down to that point this way, and I can easily. Um, now we said for me to 25 right so take this one here observe i'll take this point with this together i have this so to take this to somewhere this one right here to somewhere here to 25 so 25 from here to here 25 at this point here so i'll close here to here up and meet connect this to this observe and come here close it up this way so i have this right so this is what we have um at the hang on hang on hang on there's a mistake somewhere here i connected this point to this point i'm connecting this point here to this but with a faint line first such that this one we i'll so that i'll take this one here i'll take it down this way right so the tax is that i'll i'll not take it down this way directly since there's a um a squash um stuff here right and a, a an angle like a line here so i'll take this then a faint line here soon as i'll take this down to have so this is like what we are having at the right as of the screen in isometric production if you found this class helpful do it to like the video subscribe and click the thanks as you can see in the below the video and also share the video to our friends and classmates see you in our next class if you have any question you can send me a direct message to my whatsapp as you can see my number in front of the screen
all right see you in the next class